Hello there, everybody. Good evening. This is Amber Hawkins, your computer needs a Toledo LLC, celebrating year number 14 of computer training and more that comes to you. Visit the website at yourcomputerneeds.net. If you have any questions, click on the contact link of yourcomputerneeds.net. Call or text to 419-304-4564. You can also message me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, excuse me. Uh, Periscope, YouTube, Stumble Upon, and Instagram. This is day two of Summer Computer Maintenance, the series. Thank you all for tuning in. Make sure you let everybody know that we are live. For those who will check the archives, thank you very much. And also, help spread this video. We'll make sure this information gets out. Uh, just a quick recap. Number one, we talked about as far as summer computer maintenance, making sure that you back up your files. Number two, any old files or programs that you no longer need, make sure you delete those, clean them out. Number three, if you are unsure about doing that, seek a professional who is certified and has experience. You may have it where people are experienced but not certified or certified but not as well versed or as experienced. Not knocking that there are those who have a lot of years but they're not certified. But they have reputable businesses. Not knocking that out as well. Commend, you know, commend them. Commend them, support them. But eventually... In the computer industry, certification is important. Those that are certified, but you need to gain the experience. Anybody in the computer industry, we all know, we need to make sure we gain the experience in the process of cert getting certification or the like. To the one person joining in, thank you and hello. Uh, the three things that we're going to need for this are some scotch tape. I couldn't find the duct tape. <laughs> I was looking all over for it, but I couldn't find it. But I said, okay, going to have to make it do what it do. The tweezers, as you can see here. And also, you can see the holes of a vacuum cleaner. Oh, you may hear some dogs in the background, but just to let you know. Uh, today, it's going to be quick. What we're going to do, you're going to clean out the fan part. And it's real simple, of your laptop, uh, which is that part right there. Because over time, a lot of dust, a lot of particles can get in here. And that, if you don't clean it out, can damage your computer. I'm going to try to zoom in real, uh, to where I'm talking about. And I'm going to be using the tweezers to get it out. So I'm talking about that area right there. You see where the tweezers are and the, um, might as well say toward the upper right. Okay, let me zoom out and we're going to quickly do this. Preferably duct tape if you have the gray duct tape, that's fine. Uh, I believe the clear will work out better. What you're going to do, you're going to do it each time. You're going to be covering the parts that have vent areas because what you're trying to do and the goal is to clean out all the dust and the particles that have collected over time as far as the frequency of doing this depends on computer usage number one and also number two how you keep your area clean. Uh, this is an older computer. As you can tell, this um, needs to go through some cleaning, which will be done. If you're noticing as well, I don't have it plugged in. Make sure you have your laptop or device not only unplugged, but also off. Turn it completely off. If you've been using your device for quite a while, 
let it cool down and make sure it is unplugged. You do not want to do this and your device is still plugged in or it's still hot. Do not do this. As I said before, if this is something that's not familiar to you, make sure you seek a professional. I'm checking uh, here also on the other side to make sure I have that. Oh no, I didn't think so. So I need to make sure I get this part here. You're trying to have it where all the dust and everything is coming out and now spreading around. That should do it. I'm going to put one more layer just in case. I'm going to also let you know that when you take this off, take it off carefully. And I didn't uh, mention my apologies as far as how frequently this should be done. For me, I'm a heavy user. So for me, it's pretty much every month. Sometimes twice a month. I, had, I highly suggest at least once a month when you do this. Now, let me zoom in real quick again. Let me try to get it. If you bear with me, everybody. Try to get it as close as I can without it not focusing. Oh, there we go. As you can see, again, it's pretty, <laughs> it's pretty dirty now. It's about to get a little bit more because what we're going to do, we're going to use this hose right here to try to pull some of this dust out. You may hear the dogs in the background, just to let you know, but here we go. Again, you're getting all the dust and everything out, and you're pulling this out because you need to make sure you keep your investment maintained. Let me turn this off real quick. Let's see. As you can see right here, uh, try to zoom in some more. Quite a difference, isn't it? You will be, oh, if it's blurry, I apologize. You will be surprised how much dust collects with computer usage. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to zoom back out. I'm going to take some tweezers. You're going to have to be careful because you want to get the dust out. You don't want to stick the tweezers in. So what I'm going to do, I probably won't be able to get them all out. But at least you get the idea. I mean, just that much right there. There's a lot more, believe me. But I just want to show this part here. Let me make sure I can. Oops. Let me make sure I can show it real quick. Okay, here we go. I'm trying to show it. <laughs> Your focus. Oh, here we go. You see that right there? This is what you do not want to have inside of your investment. Okay. This can clog up the fan inside your laptop or other device. And you have to make sure that your fan it has ventilation and is free. Because if you, it does not have ventilation or a lot of ventilation, this is what can happen right here. All right. I'm going to be continuing this, but I just want to let you know that this is part of summer maintenance and this is part of care for your computers, for your desktops, for your laptops. 
It's going to be different as far as cleaning tablets. It's going to be different as far as cleaning smartphones. It's going to be different as far as cleaning a lot of computer accessories. Make sure you follow the directions on how to do it. Seek the resources needed to be able to do this. Third thing and final, if this is something that is not of your experience or you do not feel comfortable, comfortable about this, don't worry about it. Take it to a professional to make sure you have it clean. Something I mentioned yesterday, I'm going to mention each day. Make sure to please have your devices under warranty to keep it protected. You're going to be asked if you need assistance. Do you have a warranty? If you do not, guess what? Get ready to fork out some extra money because you will not be serviced if you do not have a warranty. Or if you are serviced, you're going to have to pay before you get serviced. Get the warranty now. Each time you buy a new device, be it used, be it refurbished, be it new, have protection over your devices. Now, I'll be continuing this later, but just want to show you as far as taking off the tape after you're completing, completed, excuse me, very carefully take it off. Don't use the tape that you took off to get each area that has ventilation. You're going to need to cover the area that you completely finished. As you can see, this area isn't completely finished yet, but I will be making sure to do that later. Hope this was helpful for everybody. Again, make sure you take this off. Excuse me, take this off carefully. If you have any questions, 419-304-4564. The contact link of yourcomputerneeds.net. Message me also on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Periscope, Stumble Upon, YouTube, Instagram. Amber Hawkins, your computer needs at Tilio LLC, celebrating your number 14 of computer training and more that comes to you. Thanks again, everyone. Take care. All right, let me go ahead and finish doing my own summer maintenance using this laptop and a few others that need to get done. Again, take care and thank you. Bye-bye.